Yo guys, welcome back to my channel and um, it's been a while since I did a face cam but um, we're doing it today because I wanted to tackle something. I wanted to, um, you know, do a video regarding this. So I wanted to make a video about, you know, how to, what do you say, lay out your channel. Not like how to, or, but like more specifically my way of um, doing, like doing my, how I organize my channel and all that stuff. I do a lot of spring cleanups for my channel, especially since... It's the first, uh, once, aside from like the vi the first video, in your first video anyone's gonna see from your channel, once they subscribe, they're gonna go to your channel page, and this is the most, Im one of the most important things about your channel, because it's like the, th the thing that they come back to when they look for new videos, if they're like, they'll have the notifications or anything. So, I'm, I wanna make a video about that, because a lot of people. I have seen some of my friends' channels, and I mean, there some of them are alright, but like, I think, just my personal opinion, like, I think there are some things that they could improve, or something about their channels to make it stand out a little bit more, to make it more organized, to make it more, like, easier to click on, and more easier for the eyes, and saying that, like, I was a, a pro or something, but like, this is my way, at least, that I'm comfortable with, and that you, you can, like, easily click through the playlists and stuff, so, first things first. Your channel banner and your channel profile picture. I think that's already been obvious. Um, I made mine. This is this is a base, by the way. This this thing is an anime base, and but the rest I did myself. Myself, Shin did the front face for this one, but mostly I did the editing, uh, like the hands, the background, and stuff. Yeah. So channel banner and channel trail, channel profile picture. Those are very important because, um, especially profile pictures, because of course that's the first thing that they're gonna see if you're gonna subscribe or something. That's gonna be your icon. That's gonna be what represents you. So I recommend that you make something simple. And honestly, it's really up to you for the profile picture. But if you wanna do like branding and stuff, if you wanna brand some stuff and you wanna make a channel that's like you have your own identity on YouTube. And even on any social platform that you do content on, say Twitch or Vimo, if that's what you want. But like, the very first thing that you're gonna have to do is change your profile into something that will represent your brand. So for example, um, I have myself, because um, RC, I mean that's the entire theme of this channel, is just m m my mascot, my persona, RC, which by the way, um, my persona, my mascot in Bruno is a boy, but me IRL is a girl, so it's, it's kind of confusing, but that is what represents my channel, and that's the entire brand. That's, that's the brand, that is what separates me from other channels, or at least by design, because RC is, has a very relatively simple design. It's not, a lot of gotcha, gotcha characters I see are kind of complex and they have a lot of adjustments. I kept mine really simple so that it's easier to draw, it's easier to a animate, it's easier to replicate and gotcha club, that stuff like that. So the next thing you're gonna do is your channel trailer now. I haven't, okay, I really don't, there's a rarely a lot of channels that use this, use this feature. I don't know why, <laughs> my friends, like, they don't really have a channel trailer yet. And um, here's the thing, you don't even need to have it as a channel trailer. You can have like your best video on there. So for example, like this is like when you so first you you haven't subscribed yet. If you're subscribed, it's a different video. This the is it this thing is not the, my channel trailer, but it's like my other video, my top, my favorite video, not my top video because I did horror. I don't even know, but that's like low in views for some reason. But this video is what shows up here. But, but that's if you're subscribed. If you're not so yet subscribed, it's the channel trailer. And again, it doesn't even need to be. It's like, here's your best video. Point is, it's gonna be the one, when someone visits your channel page, it will be the one, it will be the first thing that someone will watch. Like, it'll be the one that hooks you. Like, that hooks you to, you know, continue watching their content and stuff. Like, it's a trailer. Well, what do you expect from a trailer? You're gonna have like to, like, to what to anticipate, what to... What to expect from the channel, what posts are you going to be uploading, what's your schedule, what's your, that's important, important. And here's the catch, 
The reason why I'm, I'm putting emphasis on channel or trailer, I mean, again, you can put your own videos, your own, like, favorite videos, your own, like, best, vi be like, top, very high, highly viewed videos. But here's the thing. People aren't gonna watch through the, to the end. Their, their attention span, like, from, from the first few minutes of them getting to know you and your channel, they're not gonna stay for long, right? They're not gonna stay, stay for long if, it's, if the thing is too long. So if you have a long, very, very long channel trailer, that isn't gonna work. So, I recommend, um, as many um, other YouTubers recommend, like, the, like the YouTube tips, YouTubers, uh, like, they recommend one minute. Just one minute. And this, I exactly timed it to one minute so that you guys would, like, enjoy my content. And, like, like no, not enjoy my content. Like, summarize. I can summarize my content in a minute. And, yeah, that's for that. And then, for, okay, so I, here I got my playlist. So that's the next thing that I'm, I'm preserving is that playlist. So, okay. So first, okay, this is how I arrange it. This completely varies on what on the person but i will say having categories in your channels will like s separate them and like will like keep them organized and know what what content are you posting what what content are you posting what like videos are on this specific topic so so first i did my uploads because the first thing everyone's get everyone wants is like your first upload recent upload I, or that's the case for me. I don't really know about other people when they do channels, but usually I like channels that go high, have the uploads on the very top because it's easy for me to know what they've posted recently. So I would know what to expect or whatever. So the next is my other categories. So I have my vlogs, and um, I, as you can see, I haven't really posted one in. I posted one last week, but that's only because I had school. And then, yeah, I have my vlogs, I have. And then my next one is Gundam Nexus, which, by the way, I am not really. Try I'm trying to get some rest on the series for a while, but I will get back to it when I'm feeling better, which is probably not gonna be for a long while because I have school and I'm busy and stuff. But yeah, my point is that's a series. That's another category you can put on. That's a, that's you can put a, your one of your best series. You can put that video in your like keep this playlist. And then, yeah, that's that's that. And then you, this RC Trials, the next one, my favorite series so far. My top, my most favorite series. I don't even care what other people say. This is my favorite series. RC Trials is right here. So it's in the bottom of the Nexus and my Minecraft Manhunt, which we haven't really been updated. The last one was three months ago, and paint, <laughs> paint clips next because that's also one of my favorite series. Mainly because I like editing paint clips because they're all funny and she's wonderful. Go follow her, or whatever. <laughs> Okay, then we all then here we have other separate videos. This is not videos I posted. This is my pe people who have been giving me fan art gifts and all that fun stuff. This is where it goes. This is the playlist where it goes. And I would say thank you guys so much for all of this. You guys are wonderful. And there's a lot of stuff going on here. So that's that. And then my other channels, my bros channels, and like stuff. This is this is also important too. So if you want other people, this is not as important as the other ones. But if you want people to see your other stuff from your other channels or stuff, definitely add this. This is um this is gonna help like promote your other channels, and you know also if you, you can also use these other channels to separate your content. For example, RC Cousins is mainly where we post um. Mainly where I post my short TikToks, like, and my cousin's, um, like, gaming content, um, our edits, as, as, a, as like, a, well, when we, we cousins meet, um, we also have clips recorded as cousins, we also have my Minecraft, Minecraft man had, like, funny bloopers, because that's also a cousin thing, but yeah, that is... That is why we split them, and then extra RC is where my extra stuff are, the, the stuff I don't want on my main channel, and maybe some of my TikToks as well, they go there. So, yeah, 
And I also have my brother's channel, and I also have my my older cousin's channel, which is Jujala Bob. It's a group channel, and it, where they dance to K-pop stuff, which I, I like. I said my older cousin's a great dancer. And then also one more thing. This is optional, but I really personally I recommend it because it because it's really like a a great way to support your friends, to support your your the people you admire to like check out these guys too. These, this is my section in which I recommend channels. There used to be a lot of my currently I have two there because I like these two the most. Nico and Paint. They're wonderful. Again, they're wonderful. These two are wonderful. Go subscribe to them right now. <laughs> right now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but um anyways, this is I think Twitch also has this feature, but YouTube doesn't really like make it make it. I don't know. I don't know how Twitch works. I don't know what YouTube works, but like basically the, this section of your channel, though it's not, an, it is optional. It, you know, it just really puts out the fact that you belong in a community of people. You have YouTuber friends. You have um, people who you make videos with. Stuff like that. Like, it's really encouraging when someone would recommends you. You, you guys know that. You guys know when you give, when someone gives you a shout out, or someone makes a gift for you and stuff and promotes you. Much like what I've been doing with Paint and Nyx recently. <laughs> so like, it feels good, which is why it really, really is like wonderful if you would promote your friends and like you know share their content and stuff. Yeah. Um. Uh, the, like the last section. This is usually reserved for the last section so that people will check once they're done watching your content. Put a pr put a page where you can support your friends and you can promote their friends. You can put their friends on the link to your channel page so that they can click they can go to your go to their channel if they wanted to. You know, that's what I'm saying support each other. <laughs> Our next point. Your this is about face. As you can see, I joined. No, more specifically, my dad joined because this was my brother's. My older brother's account and my dad post, posted here when he was younger, like he posted Tom, like he posted these days here, but now I took over the channel. So, in this, um, like section right here, this is very important, and I don't see a lot of people like putting a lot of effort in there about pages. Usually, they just put like meme stuff or just short stuff. Mm. And while that's okay, I do believe that. Um, you know, putting what you do, like, what you, um, I think it's more better if we can, like, emphasize, emphasize what you do, your content. It's an about me page, so you have to talk about what, what your channel is, what, and what you can serve to the audience. Like, what every YouTuber says, always support your audience. Like, this YouTube is not a, is not just a job, for, just a hobby. I mean, you, it can be a hobby, but like, for the most part, YouTube's goal is to um, entertain, inform, and, you know, like, serve an audience. So, it is really important that you, like, like indicate, or, like, at least give a little indication, like, inform what you, what you can, you can possibly provide for your audience. Like, it can, you can still do content of, like, you know, for your for your own sake. Like, if you want to make a animation and show it, be cool. Like, that's great. That's wonderful. But like, you know, maybe um, what? But like, if you can tell them that, like, you know, I do art and I really and I really think you might like it. Like, what do you call it? Like, I do art and um, I was I I'm, I'm putting it here because I want I want to show it to the world and stuff. Like. You know, just your goals and um, your goals with your channel and what you want to bring. Like even if it, well, it, well, if you do it for fun, well, definitely, definitely, like you can, you can totally do that. Like, oh, I just do YouTube for fun, but I hope, but I hope it, it and I hope, like not but, but like and and I hope it uh, makes makes any of you happy. I hope you're enjoying my content, stuff like that. Like. YouTube is, um, if you want to get more subscribers on YouTube, it's, I don't want to use the term, but like, it's really, um, a matter of having to make use of 
clickbait. <laughs> but like, I'm just saying like you should like find a way to bring an audience, like differentiate your track, much like an ad. What like an ad is, you know, well, like it like catches your attention. But I'm saying this entire thing, this entire video, the entire point of this video is to catch someone's attention, and so. And to make things organized, but like for the most part, if you're gonna take this seriously and you're gonna take this, yeah, if you're gonna take it really seriously, like I am currently, I am working to get a thousand subscribers and so I can earn the money and so I can survive. But like, if you, if you're gonna take this seriously, much like I did, and you're gonna put in the hours to work and, and like also lose sanity like i did <laughs> so like you're going to have to use strategic ways to um bring in an audience and keep them there it's very important as well to keep your audience because there are people you can get a viral video right but it's not guaranteed that the people who watch the viral p video will stay all right you have to make a video that is not only going to go viral but it's going to attract more viewers so viewers to your other content so that it will stay which is kind of like why pe some people say consistency is important I, on your channel but I, I don't really believe that but like my entire channel is based on um, a variety channel and that's what I'm saying like a variety channel I, and that's the emphasis of that is the emphasis of what my channel is about so let like I said, you should, you should, if you're gonna take this seriously like I did, you're gonna have to use also strategy, you have to, um, like, have, watch the algorithm, you're gonna have to, um, do well with your thumbnails and your titles and all that stuff. You gotta really get, get, like, really get, really work for it, really, like, really work for success that is my biggest advice to all younger youtubers out there because a lot of them have quit and a lot of them i really it really hurts every time someone quits my friends quit or something it really hurts so my message to all those younger youtubers i just want to inform every single one who's just starting out this is going to get hard so um you have to really understand that youtube is going to be a lot of work like I did. If you're gonna take it uh, as a hobby that is taken seriously or like legit seriously like I am, yeah, you're gonna have to put in the work. Last point is this little page right here. It's this little bottom thing. It's your links. This is not very, I don't know if this is really important because you usually put them in your videos as well, but like this can also help promote your other stuff like your Instagram, your Discord. I have Wattpad because I have my story there. But like, your Twitch, your merch, and all of the other stuff. Like, you can promote your stuff there. And you can, like, put it there so that people can easily click on it and stuff. So, yeah, that's it for my layout of the channel video. Let me know if you have any other ideas for videos. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe. You know, yeah, just the subscribe button here would be a little bit. Be sure to like subscribe be on the lookout for other other videos and i will see you guys in the next one goodbye <laughs>